Hi guys, so today we will talk a little bit about uh, how to write an effective paragraph. So the objectives of today's lesson is to identify and learn the components of a well-developed paragraph and to practice writing the first draft. You might wonder why I have chosen to talk about writing a paragraph, why not uh, something else, for example an essay. Simply because if you master writing a paragraph, you, you will master writing uh, any other form or forms of writing. What? What is this? Hamburger? So what a hamburger has to do with writing a paragraph? That's weird. No, it's not. So an effective paragraph should look exactly like a hamburger. With the three main components. Top, middle, details, and bottom. Now, as you can see, the hamburger has changed it to a writing template so all paragraph should look exactly like this an introduction at the top supporting details examples explanations linking words and a conclusion yep okay here is a perfect hamburger paragraph as you can see, we have an introduction, it's called the topic sentence. We have details, first, second, uh, finally, and we have conclusion sentence. As a result, Canada is a desirable place to live. If you pay more attention to the paragraph, you will see that every word, every sentence, every expression serves a particular purpose. So the topic sentence in, is introducing the, the, the topic of the paragraph and then supporting details or sentences and linking words and the conclusion sentence. Here is a little exercise for you. So. I would like you to read this paragraph very carefully and try to identify or extract the topic sentence, supporting sentences or details, linking words and the concluding sentence. You can write your, uh, your answers below the video in the comment sections. Here is a little analysis of the paragraph. So. We, we basically have seven sentences, so the topic sentence and supporting sentences and after each supporting sentence there is a, a, an example that explains the sentence in more details and of course there is a concluding sentence and linking words. Okay, time to practice writing a paragraph. So here you are going to write a paragraph about three advantages of the internet in your life as a student. So it's very important to pay attention to the question. So three advantages mean three supporting sentences. Okay, so use the cues below to help you. You can write your paragraph and leave it in the comments section. Okay, this is the end of our video. So in the next lesson, we will, uh, or let's say, I will show you a way to self-correct your paragraph. Okay, and uh, you now, if there are any paragraphs in the comment section, we'll correct them together. Okay, thank you. Goodbye.